Capitol where our Diana Co is standing by. Diane. Okay. All right. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Rick and Marissa. Thank you so much for putting up with our technical difficulties. Um, we are going to read off some of the numbers, some of which you may have already covered. Uh, so for some of the top races that have come in, and keep in mind this printout came out just like five minutes ago. U.S. Senator, as we've heard, Brian Schatz giving his victory speech, uh, he had 227,825 votes. Uh, the nearest competitor was Bob McDermott, Republican, getting 69,000 155 votes. For U.S. Representative District 1, Ed Case at 116,026 votes uh, against Conrad Kress getting 34,323. U.S. Representative District 2, Joe Tokuda, 98,827. And the next nearest person, Joe Akana, a Republican, coming in at 45,971. Governor and Lieutenant Governor, as many of the pundits had predicted, uh, Josh Green and Sylvia Luke, that ticket, came in at 206,000 votes, 206, 47, 479,000 votes, as compared to the Republican ticket of Duke Iona and Seo Ula Tupai at 100 and 707. Uh, let's move on to the next set of races. All right, let's look at the OHA vote. So Hawaii resident trustee vacancy for OHA. Mililani Trask takes it at 130,534 votes. Her next nearest opponent, or her only other opponent, Hope Surmelge, at 80,310. And then for the at-large trustee, they're looking for three seats. So the top, the top candidates coming in is Brickwood Galateria, John Wahei IV, and Keoni Souza. Maui Mayor, as uh, Marissa and Rick had mentioned. Here's the Maui Mayor. R Richard Bisson is, has more of the votes at 17,501 versus the incumbent Mike Victorino, 12,651. And then let's move on to the Mayor of Kauai. County of Kauai, Derek Kawakami, 11,340 votes versus Michael Poai at 2,484. And then we have four city council seats open here in Honolulu. So I'll just read the names of the people who are winning at this moment. Matt Ware over Makua Rothman. Matt Ware has 9,155. Uh, that's for District 2. District 4. Tommy Waters has 23,287 votes. District 6, Tyler Dos Santos Tam at 10,307 votes. That's who Paul Drews was just interviewing five minutes ago. Council member for District 8, Val Aquino Okimoto at 17,408 votes. And just a note here, total registration for the voters, or rather total vote turnout so far, 311 311,578 votes. That represents 36.2% of voters. So there we have the results of the first printout. Some of the key races, I'm sure Neil will go over many more with uh, Rick and Marissa in the minutes to come, but that's the, lot. That's the latest from the state capitol. We are live, Diana Ko, KITV4 Island News.